Hi. Hi, we're live. We're live. We're gonna go into this Goodwill. Ooh. So this is our secret Goodwill. Secret. We're not gonna tell nobody where it is. Yeah, no one else knows, not including all the people. Including right the outside. people waiting outside. <laughs> they don't know where it is. Anyways, we're gonna go in there and see if we can find anything. Um, we need some stuff for our, our live sales. We need we uh -huh. need we need the thrift store prices. That's what yeah. we need most of all. That's what we need. That. So we're gonna go on there, go in there, and hopefully the thrift gods will be with us. <laughs> That's all we can hope. All right. Um, well, we got a few more minutes, so we'll wait. But with the magic of YouTube, we'll You'll go in, right there in there and go shopping. Okay, let's see what we can find. Oh, that's cool. A bit of splatter glass. Hmm, let me hold that in my little hand cart. Erin <sighs> had to go take a potty break like I did. Oh, these are Homer Laughlin. These are restaurant wear. Well, they, well, the ones I had were. Nope, these say Sterling. Mine were Homer Laughlin, just like that. What are those? It's an interesting pasta cucina. Some kind of pineapple. Well, yeah, I don't see it on this first aisle. No. That's the first aisle I checked. Oh, well, I'm supposed to read your brain. You are. <laughs> okay. Just some dishes here. Let me go to the next aisle. You want to hold this for me? Sure. Kind of go like this. This is all new stuff. Yeah, this is the newer things. New. Was it this one? Okay, I'll check this one next. He wanted to show me something. Oh, I see a little whale. Oh, and look at those cute little roosters. That's pretty neat. Not really. Not really. These are cool. I like these. Ooh, did they scribble it out? They did. Why would you do that? I don't know. Twelve ninety eight. I kind of like these, babe. These are kind of neat. Stick them in the thing. Look at these little ballerinas. Is this the aisle you saw? No, that was it. No. Jeez, you don't know where you are. Where located. <laughs> Any hidden crafts in here? Oh, that's a sign. Oh, Aaron's waiting for his Starbucks and your Red Bull. Yeah. I mean, what's this guy doing? A net. A cat safety net. Huh. Avon. Oh, yeah. what's this? This is pretty. Let me see this. Oh, it's got a big chip. Of course you do. Story That's really life. nice, though. Look at that. That's cool. And then we have this, like, little Japanese. I think it's Japanese. She kind of looks like a geisha. Kind of, sort of. So did someone already get what you wanted to show me? Well, oh, up here. Yeah, they were just a little too pricey, I think, for what they are. Yeah, so he wanted, I think he said this, 798. Yeah. I mean, I'm just more surprised that it's actually here, so that's, that's kind of cool. Company. And then he wanted to show me this. These are usually like Teleflora. That blue one back there is kind of neat. This big thing? Yeah, that's kind of nice one. Does it feel? No. Made in Spain. Feels very cheap. Get it? Oh, it does feel lighter than I thought. 15 bucks. Okay. Oh, look at this little. Wait, oh, it's flashed. Never mind. Looked cool from a distance. These. What were these? Were they Avon? Let's see. Ah, <laughs> they were. That's funny. 
They remind me of the moon and stars pattern. That's cool. Okay, let me go back. Let me backtrack over here. Oh, these are pretty. It's got a little bit of some chipping. But look at that, it has a whole little set here. Hmm, this big old ashtray, Oldsmobile, curved dash, runabout, 1901. That's neat. Everything's so neat. It's a great teapot there. Another Avon bottle. Look at this cool lion. Yeah, someone donated like their cool bottle collection from Avon. Yeah, they're interesting. These used to do better. Yeah. The little uh, made in Japan figurines and stuff, the occupied Japan stuff. A little Boyd's bear. Apparently, the ones with little sweaters and stuff can do really well. That's a little cute duck. See, these are the things that used to do really good. And these too, like these little vases and stuff. Um, but now I think just everyone has them. That shops our sales anyway. Oh, I looked at that last time. That was a few weeks ago when I was looking at this little wall pocket and someone's like, oh, you should have got it, but it was broken right here. Maybe I'll get it this time. It's a little handmade Christmas wall pocket. Oh, it was broken in a couple spots. Maybe I'll just leave it. Oh, maybe I'll leave it. Because what happens is um, like say it's like, I don't know, already broken or already has a crack. Then when we ship it, it might break even more or break, you know, for good. Let's see. Hmm. Material. Other back turtle. Blue sky. Oh, blue sky. Hmm. That has a lot of crazing. I wonder, I'm gonna look this up, blue. I've never seen a blue sky thing like that. And that's cool. It's missing its lid. <laughs> that's interesting. Angels. Hmm. Okay. I'm gonna look that stuff up. Oh, how cute. I'm gonna look that up now. So this right now is listed for 25 for best offer for this here. And then there's sets. I didn't see this particular jar, but there's like sets that people did listing them for like 50 or best offer, but I don't see any solds. So, and this has, this one has quite a bit of crazing, but they're pretty like inexpensive for a live sale. So I don't know. That's cool. Mm -hmm. Gosh, I don't know. Someone's probably screaming, get it, Alex. Just get it. What is this? A false graph bowl? No. Is it? No. What is this here? It has a signature. Hazel Mather. 298 for that. Okay. I think I'm gonna go check the next aisle. We were talking about this. Well, this is cool, but he's missing a lid. Then we were talking about this. This is that blue sky oh, yeah. um, ceramics. This right now is listed for like $25. This goes with it. it, has a lot of crazing. They have listings for like a set for like 50 on eBay, mm -hmm. but there's no sold. So I come like going back and forth like, yeah. mm, should I get it for a live sale? Should I not? I don't know, what is this? Oh, it's an angel. This looks pretty, actually. Let me look at this thing with the shamrock or whatever it is on there. Oh, it's got a big old chip, but I want to see. Oh, it's Russ. Okay. All right, I'm off to another aisle. All right, we got the metal aisle. 
sometimes you can find some good like enamel pans and stuff you can clean up. Reset. Oh yeah. The blue definitely looked like the moon and stars. So I was like, this has to be, with that lid, this has to be Avon. And that just sure was. Well, here's some, you can make assemblage things with like the vintage cupcake tins and stuff. You can make some cool looking things with those. Here's a smash journal. These are really popular back in the day. Same idea as the junk journal. Flamingos. Kind of looks like a paint by number. Oh, those are neat. Oh, is it broken? I think it's broken. Those are cool. Just a little box. We got some really cool wooden boxes at the flea market. They nest inside each other. They're pretty neat. Oh, that's cool. USS, USS Arizona. That's a neat thing. Pearl Harbor Commemorative Collection. Huh, from 2001. From the Bradford Exchange. That's what that little thing is. It's over the wreck. Oh, this memorial? Aw. Oh, these are cool. Oh, it's attached to this. I was going to say, these numbers are so neat. But they're they're attached. you got to buy the whole shebang bang Oh, my finger hurts. This is a cool little holder. Little organizer. There's a crate down there. There's a couple of crates you can like DIY. We just saw a guy at the flea market that actually had some old crate labels. So you can like put a crate label on there. Interesting, interesting. Oh, that's cute too. Oh look, oil pastels, paint. They had their crafts in here. That's neat. I love these things. There's this one antique store and they have this huge, like it's huge, um, like cubbies. It's like all different cubbies. These look like hieroglyphics. How does it open? Oh, here, there's a drawer up front. But um, I so want the cubby thing. Some kind of game. Yeah. That's neat. I might get the cubby thing one day. Look at the little kitty toy. Who's gonna sit on that? I know. Right? Thump will Keep break it. Thing. Thump would break that. Okay, any kind of good coffee makers or we need stuff for our peoples. No, ceramic the clock. So like if we could find like in a good shape, you know, like a, like, what is this? A rice cooker? Probably, um, you know, things like that. that are in kind of good shape, you know? It kind of looks like a turtle. What is that? Oh, that's neat, look. It probably worked. We just sold like a red one. We did. On eBay. That's looks cool. like a hang on the wall one. Look, a little microwave. I don't know if it works, but that looks right really there. nice. On the inside, these just look a little poopy. But twelve ninety eight, yeah, and then like radios, you know. Oh, that's just. This There's stuff. a Pioneer Woman crock pot. Wow. I just want to see what they have on it. Ten dollars. No, it's not. That's neat. Well, that's a steamer. Steam booster. That's a steamer. A little TV here. A little miniature glue gun. It's so cute. <laughs> Got a toaster oven. So there's all kinds of stuff that we can look like we can 
look at here. That's a nice looking one. Crock pot, $10. Yeah, that's a good price too. Yeah, look, there's a couple more back there. Yeah. A dozen of those things there, you know? Yeah. All right. All right, so, oh look, nostalgia toaster, retro pop-up toaster. Hmm. It's, you stick a hot dog in Oh, that would explain down. why that looks a little rusty, because it would get wet. That's interesting. And Look at that, I just noticed that. That's kind of That's cool, neat. Actually. Yeah. We just microwave huh. those suckers. Yeah, well, that probably toasted nice. Yeah. Toast your buns. Toast your buns. <laughs> oh, this is their little Christmas aisle. Um, I was already kind of peeking through here. I uh, didn't really see any like craziness that I can show you. Like, look at this. It's all broken. Ugh, stay. But they do have like some pretty little ornaments. Um, yeah. Just says diamond. Okay. All right. This would be cute for like a little village. No Santa mugs. Peppermint. What is that? Oh, it's a sifter. That's cool. I bet this looks pretty when it has a candle in it. Someone made that. They altered it a bit. We have, oh look, the bass. Oh, it's one of the Goodwill's items though. And we have some nutcrackers. These, you could totally buy and make them your style, you know? These used ones, you can remove all their hair if you wanted, and then like spray paint them, you know, modernize them a smidge. Or leave them like they are. <laughs> That's a little bit of Halloween stuff. Bunch of trolls tissues over there. But I think that's gonna be it for this store. Um, we have a few things in our cart here. We got some of these vintage ballerina prints, some beaded chickens, a stone whale, this little splatter glass. And then I found some ceramic chopsticks for Gabriel. So that's what I see. Oh, that's cool. Little signs. Hey, so. What? Okay, you ready? Ready. Dang. <laughs> we knew this was big lots. This is all new stuff. I know. But, okay. So I think we're gonna head out, I guess. We gotta go continue on our mission to go see Grandma Patty. Let's see how. I gotta go. She needed, She wants some peppermints and I need to get her some tissues. So we have to go. So wait, what is that? We have to swing by cable. Oh, cable connections, connectors. Antenna connections. Like we gotta swing by the grocery store before we go. Um, see her and get her some popcorn chicken. Yep. She wants some popcorn chicken for lunch. I don't blame her. Sounds good. Alright guys. Well, we hope you enjoyed today's video. We do. And we will talk to you in another one. Very soon. Bye. <laughs>